<laughs> to a lot of kids, English class is that class you try really hard not to sleep through. And poetry? I mean, who really likes poetry? But these aren't those kids. Poetry is music without the notes. It's beautiful, it's art. You learn to think critically about who we are as people. Bridget Smith and Kai Fisher are two of the best high school English students in the country, each winning awards in the New York Times Found Poetry Contest. Unannounced, she broke into a spontaneous dance of life. Kai took third place for his poem Free, among 2,400 entrants. I was stunned, I was like, whoa, I, I did not expect it. It was amazing. Bridget Smith took top honors for her poem When You're 15 Years Old. She found out about the English Award while perusing the New York Times in Spanish class. It was, it was really strange. I thought it was a mistake because I didn't get an email. So it was it was pretty surreal. The Thanksgiving table is a war zone. The soldiers, the conservative aunt who drove all the way from Alabama, the ultra progressive sibling who makes passive aggressive comments while passing the potatoes. Bridget also took top honors for her editorial Dinner Table Politics, besting more than 9,000 other writers and getting published in the New York Times as a sophomore in high school. All told, 15 Edmonds Woodway students either placed, took top honors, or got an honorable mention in the contest. Unheard of, says English teacher Nancy Branham, and a nice cherry on top of her educational Sunday as she's retiring at the end of this school you know, year. The, my kids caught their attention with their writing, and that for an English teacher is really important. One teacher's chapter closing, and many more still to be written for her students. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.